I woke up this morning and I was sweating a whole bunch and I wonder why it was so hot in my room. So I went to my window, opened my blinds and opened my window and it was pretty hot outside so I checked my phone and the temperature said it was 85 degrees. For the past two weeks it's been in the low to mid 40s and I got used to cooler temperatures. I was leaving my window open at night and just getting a cool breeze of air and I didn't have to have my air conditioner inside anymore which was a plus and that saves me on my electric bill because then my electric bill isn't like a hundred dollars or anything. Using my electric bill runs between averages between fifty to sixty dollars but it got really hot today and I thought about putting my air conditioner back in the window but I didn't feel like dealing with the whole hassle of trying to put the little cardboard in the sides because the little things that you push out on the sides that keep like bugs from coming in it keeps the cool air in and the hot air outside those they go all the way across but there's always a little crack in the window and I've had that problem with any air conditioner I've ever had so I have two little pieces of cardboard that I cut that I put on each side of it and I put those up and that's how I always done it keeps the air out and it's cheap convenient but anyways I thought about putting the air conditioner in but I didn't feel like dealing with the whole hassle of it so I just I just dealt with the hot air the pen that I'm using for this drawing is called the Jimny Gel Rollerball Gel Pen it has a blue ink and it goes really smooth in the paper I've got an entire container of them I think I've got maybe I don't know 60 of them I think and I have other gel pens as well I have the pilot ones and I think it's the 207 but I think I like these more they they flow better onto the paper they're a lot smoother I think it's the 207s if I can take a look here they yeah the uni uniball Signo 207 what I notice about these pens is that when I'm drawing with them the end of it like the tip of the pen the size of the tip isn't the same size as the cap so when I'm drawing with it there's a slight movement and it kind of gets annoying I'm not sure if you can hear this but I'll take a listen to it and tell me if you can hear this that's when you're drawing with it like when you're touching something the end of it moves a little bit and it kind of frustrates me and gets annoying especially when I'm doing stippling because I'll try to stipple and the whole time I just keep hearing that sound over and over and uh, it does get to be a bit frustrating but today was a pretty good day it was really hot outside but other than that things were fine um, I've been very busy today working on drawings editing things and I did a different setup for my video I moved the lamp that I have for the lighting over to the side more and I moved my small camcorder that I use for the time lapses to a different angle and I also moved my DSLR that I use for the recordings at a different angle as well and I forgot about this for some reason I don't know why but for the past eight months I've been drawing on a flat surface and I wonder why my neck was hurting me so bad and then when I was just working on the setup I had put my desk at a 45 degree angle and I was drawing and I was like why did I forget this? I don't know how I forgot this, but yeah, it, it makes drawing a lot better. It makes my neck not hurt. It makes it to my back's not hurting. And some days when I'm drawing a lot, I just don't feel like drawing because my back or, or my neck will be hurting me. And so I think this will resolve part of the issue, but I still have to get a different computer chair because the chair I have right now is pretty much falling apart. I've had this chair for maybe 10 years now and it's made of like some kind of it's not leather it's, but it's it's falling apart and I need to get a different one I'm looking around online but I don't know what type of chair to get because I want one that will be good for my posture but a lot of the chairs I see are not good for your posture and they're just like big and bulky I just want something simple that's comfortable that will be good for me to draw in I would I mean I want if it does have arms in the chair I want to be able to remove the arms or like fold them up 
so they're not in a way because of the setup I have where my computer desk is it's at an L shape and if I turn I'm hitting the desk and I took the arms off the chair I have now because of that problem anyways I'm gonna go work on some more drawings with more of these Jimmy gel pens all the ones I have are just blue I want to get red and black ones as well but if you enjoyed this share it with your friends like comment and subscribe and if you have any drawing suggestions, go ahead and let me know in the comments below, and I will see you in the next video.